And it does excite me, yeah, because I was brought up in school to believe that if you're an artist, you couldn't be a scientist, and if you're a scientist, you could not be an artist, you couldn't be a musician. So I've kind of fought for that all my life. So to me, it is very important, and it's very interesting to do this. Um, yeah, I, I get up every day and feel curious about everything and feel excited about stuff which has never been done before. And it's starting to, to blend together more and more at this moment, I think, as I, as I stand here before you guys, who are mainly scientists, you know, but all of you, I notice, are interested in, in the musical side and in the, in the artistic side. And so many astronomers um, nowadays are musicians or artists and whatever, astronauts too. I'm lucky enough to have spent time with, with a lot of astronauts. Most of them have some kind of artistic leanings. Um, and I feel that, that mankind is kind of coming back together and putting the two halves of its existence together. And I think art and science should be more connected. And I think science will be more inspired if it allows itself to become more instinctive. And music will be better for allowing science into it. You know, science meaning knowledge. You know, the original mean, meaning of science is knowledge. You know, knowledge is what informs everything we do. And as human beings, we procreate. We continue our species, but if there's some other reason to be here, then it's somewhere in this area of discovering the world around us. I think that's the gift that mankind has been given. Online Coffee Break.